What's up everybody? In this video, I'm gonna show you Bitcoin Ordinals wallet. So if you decide to get into Bitcoin Ordinals, maybe try to buy their MIM tokens or maybe NFT Ordinals or something like that, you will have to have Ordinals wallet. It's slightly different. It's not an actual Bitcoin wallet. So there are a few different options out there, but I'm gonna show you my favorite one. So there is one, it's called Ordinals wallet so it's this one right here and they already have a marketplace as well but this wallet is kind of like a browser based they don't have actual like extension added to your browser and i'm not even sure if it's supported on a mobile device so this is one of the options but this is not my favorite but if this is what you prefer you can use this one and let's say for example if you're going to go to ordinalswallet.com and let me switch to a different page because i already created one it's gonna look like this and right here you'll just have to either restore wallet or create a wallet and i guess if you created previously through some kind of another either extension or an app or something like that you can restore a wallet using that phrase and my favorite wallet it's called xverse so the reason why i really like xverse because it's chromium based wallet so it's only supported on chromium based browsers and at the same time they already have a mobile app for android and iphones so if we go to xverse.app and we press on download so right here there's going to be an option and you can actually find an app store or google play store if you're on a mobile device or if you are on desktop you'll just have to download for chrome and i'm actually using brave but it's chromium based so it's going to be out there you just press on download this page is going to appear then just press to add to brave or to chrome or any other chromium based browser that you're using and then add an extension once extension is going to be added you'll have to click on this little puzzle if it's not going to appear over here and then you'll have to pin so that way it's always going to be over here then we'll just press on it and then here is going to be two different options either to create or restore if you have already wallet you can just press on restore wallet or create new wallet i'm just going to go through this process really quick so right here we can press on next or we can just skip and then accept terms and conditions you can either press back up now and it's going to show you your seed phrase or backup later you can always go back type your password and then view your seed phrase and right here just gonna have to type a password and that's it close this tab while it is created and we can go actually back over here and then press on xverse extension and then we need to type our password and then unlock okay once it's gonna unlock you'll see account one and then balance send receive and buy btc and stx but this is your bitcoin wallet so what you need to do you need to actually press right here on ordinals and this is where you're going to see all your nfts or ordinals and then if you press on receive you'll see different type of address and if you are buying nft or something like that this is the address you'll be using or receiving your nft and if we press on copy you'll get this message it says use this address to receive ordinals only do not use this address to receive bitcoin payments and this is pretty much it and then if we go here you can start stacking and then some settings right here you can change fiat currency network update password backup wallet that's what we need to do if you're going to be using this wallet make sure you do the backup so you save your seed phrase and then just some other settings right here and then one more thing i want to show you if we go to accounts you press on it you'll have only one account you can create second third and as many as you would like here's the thing though you cannot rename this account so like for example if you would like this to be main account and maybe a saving account and something else whatever i'm not sure why you can't do that but you just can't the only way to rename this wallet you're actually gonna have to buy like a btc domain so for example bitcoin ordinal dot btc or whatever name you decide to choose john smith dot btc once you do that then this name will be changed otherwise it's gonna stay account one and account two maybe later on in the future they're going to be able to change that but at this time this is not possible and then if you need to get your bitcoin wallet you can just press on here receive and you'll see bitcoin and then ordinals this is two different types of wallet just gotta keep that in mind 
and this is pretty much it i'm gonna leave a link for xverse website in the description below and for the other one as well just in case if you would like to check out both of them and good luck to everybody with btc ordinals thanks for watching